Hey everybody, this is Brad from Argali and this is our Mule Deer e-scouting video series. So I'm gonna give you sort of five tips and tricks that I use for scouting for mule deer hunting that you can do from your desktop at home to make more efficient use of your time in the field and increase your chances of success. Before I do that though, um, if you wouldn't mind, go and hit that subscribe button uh, down in the corner of your screen, I would certainly appreciate it. So this video series is really about once you've already drawn a tag or you already know where you're roughly, the unit you're gonna go in, going into, how you can uh, make more efficient use of your time um, once you've already drawn that tag or know where you're gonna go. This is not about how to find a unit to hunt. Um, we'll cover that in a separate, in a separate video another time. So uh, first thing that I like to do, and these are, these are small things that I like to do from my desktop, um, and I use Onyx Maps to do all this stuff. I do it on my desktop, and then everything I do on my desktop automatically transfers to the app on my phone, making it really easy for when I transfer from uh, my office out into the field. So the first thing, um, and I think this is something that uh, a lot of people don't think about very often, is that every time you leave your truck, whether you're at a trailhead or you're off trail, that you want to be uh, as invisible as you possibly can be as you get up into the country that you are hunting. So you should be thinking about being in stealth mode the minute you leave your truck. And for me, what that really means is, let's say if I'm backpacking into an area or let's say I'm just even hiking into an area to hunt, there might be several miles of country that you're gonna cover where you don't expect to see any game or any big deer or deer that you wanna hunt. Um, but you should be thinking about like what can see me uh, when I am walking into the country that I want to hunt. So what I like to do is map out the route that I want to take into a place uh, on my desktop. Now, if you're hiking in a trail for all or part of the way, this can be fairly easy. You can sort of use the map, use the line tool and sort of draw out your route on your desktop. Oftentimes for me, I'm using some trails, sometimes it's off trail, sometimes it's completely off trail. Well, it's helpful for me to think about how I can sort of say hidden or as hidden as possible by mapping out that route in advance so I know exactly where I'm gonna go um, and I'm not alerting uh, deer that I deer to my presence that I think may be in the places where they're gonna be. So um, what I do is essentially just take that line tool and you just start clicking your way um, using topo mode and satellite imagery and kind of using 3D mode and 2D mode to find a, a walkable path. Sometimes that might mean taking some finger ridges. It might mean staying off the side of a ridge so you don't skyline yourself. Um, but just really mapping out that route so I know exactly how I'm gonna get into that country and without being detected by the deer that hopefully are in there. So that's tip number one. Be sure and watch our second video for tip number two in our mule deer scouting series.